In my almost 30 years of covering sports here, the single most shocking story was Mike Schilt getting fired. Three full seasons, three playoff appearances, and one Manager of the Year award. I thought he was going to get a gold watch, instead he got a pink slip. He hasn't really opened up about it until today with Bob Nightingale from USA Today. This is what Schilt said. I have a broken heart. It still hurts. It hurts bad. When it first happened, I broke down. I was inconsolable. I got better as time went on. Then I got down here, put on a Padres uniform, and it hit me. I never thought it was a possibility. It hit me like a ton of bricks. Earlier today, I talked with Bob Nightingale and asked why Mike was fired. Uh, maybe if he had just stayed in his own lane, focus I mentioned the Cardinals, and didn't offer any input on what's going on in different uh, aspects of organizations, the minor leagues, and things like that. You know, I think when he was having success too, you know, kind of empowered him more to have a, a bigger voice. And uh, maybe, maybe they didn't want to hear what he was saying, saying, hey, you stick to managing, we'll, we'll, we'll do the rest. Tony LaRusso was also quoted in the article because he had heard a comment from someone inside the Cardinal organization that Schilt was fired because of a toxic environment. LaRusso was angry because that could affect future employment for Mike. Tony called Schilt a special guy.